Hi guys, hope you're all well. I'm really sorry that I've been like MIA for almost a month now. Life's just been, mm, I don't know, just getting on with life really and I haven't found time to film without like interruptions so I thought I'd sneak a cheeky video in today. Um, a while back I asked my Instagram whether you guys would like to see um, like swatches and reviews of the Colourpop liquid lipsticks that I've got recently. Um, I got four of them. I've got four different colours to show you. Um, so I'm just going to kind of review them, swatch them for you and just generally let you know what I think of them. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first one that I'm wearing now is Lumiere 2. So in the tube it kind of looks like a really lovely rose pink colour but as you can see it, on my lips it actually changes more to a purple shade. Almost like a MAC heroin kind of um, shade. Also I think it oxidises to kind of like a different colour. What I do find is that if I apply more than one coat then it does start to feel a little tacky on the lips, a little bit like a bit chalky. Um, so I try to just stick to one layer if I can. For Lasting Power itself I am really impressed with these. These are the first kind of lipsticks I've had where I can actually wear them to dinner or like not worry about what it's going to look like after I have a meal which I've really enjoyed because I've always had an issue with like MAC lipsticks. Um, they just come off my lips as soon as I eat and it's just you just don't look good after but with these you don't have to worry about it you can still eat and drink with them and they'll still stay on the lips really well so I have been so impressed with these so in terms of cost these cost six US dollars each which is unbelievable they're so so cheap so what um, me and a group of girls at work do is we all put in an order um, and then we just split the postage when we get it delivered to Singapore in terms of postage costings, I think four of us ordered last time and we ended up paying like two sing dollars each for postage so it's really not that much, um, especially when the products are so cheap. I know they, they don't retail in the UK but they possibly deliver to the UK, I'm not sure. But I do know that they definitely deliver to Singapore so I would say it's 100% worth it, especially when the products themselves are so cheap. So this next one is called Kapow. This one is a very mauve grey kind of shade, almost with like a violet tint. I don't think Kapow is a colour that everyone can pull off, but if you're gutsy, I would definitely say just give it a go. So Limbo is your true chocolate brown colour. I would say it's very similar to the Kylie Lip Kit colour, which she has, I think it's called True Brown maybe. Um, this is your true brown colour. I love this a lot. I think it's definitely something I'd wear more in the evening. And I think I definitely have to pair this one with the right kind of outfit. If I'm wearing like mauves or khaki colours, this is definitely something I'd pair it with. It goes really nicely with that kind of pastel pink as well. But it's definitely a very dark, bold brown on my lips. But yeah, I love this a lot. I need to start wearing it more. But So moving on to the next one, I have Beeper which is one of my favourite ones. I will say again, this looks slightly different on um, as it does in the tube. So in the tube, it looks like a very mauve coloured kind of nude. Um, when it goes on, it's slightly grey on my lips um, and I think it comes up a, a little bit darker than it does in the tube. Nevertheless, I really like it. It's like a very kind of greyish mauve colour. My friend at work also got the same colour, but it does look slightly different on her lips. So I definitely think, and she's Singaporean, so I think it definitely will vary on what kind of skin colour you have but I absolutely love this. I also just ordered another one of their ultra matte lipsticks in um, a red shade just because I wanted a nice red shade that I can as I said like wear to dinner and not have to worry about my food and drink like taking it off so yeah I'm looking forward to that one but yeah I just wanted to show you those four that I have. Obviously I've really stuck to the um, the nude kind of palette this time around because that's what everyone's wearing at the moment um but i'm super happy with these for six dollars each like you cannot complain um and really cheap postage as well don't keep layering them and you'll be absolutely fine with them i've been really really happy with the results so far so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it was helpful hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and i will see you next time bye guys this next top is a favourite of mine. It is again the plush pink colour, and it has and it says milk on it with a little glass of milk. I just thought it was really cute. Um, this is really great material. It's like really quite thick. That's really nice. Um, it's not flimsy at all, and it's a really nice length. So I love wearing that with like a black pair of clocks.